to remember those who lost their lives serving. Service for our country and uh, here at home. Keith Whiteman and Steve Robbins joins us to talk about the 9-11 Heroes Run. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Well, good morning. Well, let's start first of all, what is this? And this is actually a new run for Columbus, right. but not, not nationally. Right, nationally they've had the run, the Travis Mannion Foundation has had the run for several years. They have 55 runs going around the world and across the country. This is our third year here in Columbus. And tell okay. us about the Travis Mannion Foundation. So the Travis Mannion Foundation was started by the family of Travis Mannion, who was a Marine First Lieutenant, Naval Academy graduate, to honor him and all those heroes since 9-11 who've lost their lives, fire, police, emergency responders, and military. And Keith, um, this race it kind of affects you on a personal level. Tell us about that. Uh, well, uh, my son, uh, Lance Corporal Brett Whiteman, uh, died in Iraq in 2005. Uh, he was a Lima company. Uh, they were deployed there. And uh, we uh, did it this year. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're going to do it uh, <laughs> again. Absolutely. And I see that you're also wearing t shirts um, in honor of him. And if your, your family is here as well? Uh, yes. Uh, actually, uh, Sonia uh, started uh, Team Whiteman, and uh, we brought 25 runners, I think it was, uh, up there uh, last year, and uh, it, uh, it honored my boy. Absolutely, absolutely. Is it hard to get this all together after a loss like that for anyone who's going through something similar, or were you eager to jump in? At first, uh, it's been nine years. Mm -hmm. It's been nine years. And uh, at first, uh, I saw a lot of good people, a lot of good people uh, do good things uh, for his memory. At first, yes. Yes, uh, I wanted to be alone. Uh, but over the years, uh, it's gotten easier. Uh, we, we always want them to be remembered. Absolutely. And, you know, we're talking about um, that Keith and his family and his situation, but th this run honors more than just the military as well. True, it does. It honors the memory of all those fallen heroes, police, military, fire, uh, emergency responders since 9-11. Uh, we take the time. We have uh, the money goes toward the Travis Mannion Foundation, to uh, do programs for veterans and families of fallen heroes to honor their fallen heroes. And locally here, it goes to the Westerville Firefighters Memorial Scholarship Fund to fund those uh, in Ohio who are interested in pursuing a career in the fire department. And real quick, tell us when and where again? It is next Saturday, uh, September 6th at 9 a.m. at Alum Creek Park in Westerville. And we have a pre-race ceremony at 8.30. All right, and anybody can run, right? Run, walk, donate, cheer, just honor the fallen. Absolutely. Steve Robbins, Keith Whiteman, thank you guys so much for coming in. To find out more about the run and how to help honor our fallen heroes, visit our website. Visit myfox28columbus.com. Coming up on Good Day Columbus, Phil Kelly will have another check of your forecast. And we'll be right back.